So whenever you find yourself riding with somebody, always be sure who you ride with because it might actually break your butt. This is Story Arcs and I'm Art. And this is about that time that I broke my butt. So when I was in med school, I was at a friend's house studying one night and it got kind of late. It was like 10, 11 p.m. And I was like, all right, man, you know, we studied enough. I'm going home, I'm gonna get some sleep or whatever. And in the DR, they have these things. In a lot of third world countries, they have them. So it's a motorcycle who acts as a taxi cab. You know, you just jump on the back of the motorcycle, he takes you where you go, you pay. And that's the way it was. Nowadays, they got Uber and everything like that, but they still have the motoconchos. So this night I get out of my friend's house, it's like 10 or 11, he's walking me out to the sidewalk where I'm gonna go, you know, hail down a motoconcho and go home. And we hail down this motoconcho, dude comes, I get on, and instead of like taking his time, it's, it's a busy avenue, right? Even at 10 p.m., it was like, you know, cars and stuff like that. And I guess he was drinking or something, because as soon as I get on, old boy just blows out into a U-turn. And when he does this U-turn, this car comes from behind us and just smacks straight into the motorcycle on the front, right? So the motorcycle did a full U-turn. And as soon as we did that full U-turn, this car comes and hits us right from the front. And when he did that, I went flying in the air. Oh, my God. And I landed Wee. straight square on my butt. And it hurt so bad. I'm talking about like ridiculous pain. It hurt so bad that I couldn't move. I was just like frozen, laid out on the on the concrete, right? And there was this truck coming. And I seen the truck, but it was like, it was almost like I was knocked out, but from my butt, right? <laughs> and so my man Jose comes and he runs to the middle of the street and grabs me and he pulls me up onto the other side of the street, you know? And the truck just passed by, like the truck's gonna run me over. And he's like, yo, you all right, you all right? And I was like, dude, I, I don't even know what's going on right now. You know, like I was knocked. And then the, the people came and they picked up the motor control off the street and all this kind of stuff. And they got like a taxi cab or something or somebody, they called somebody, I don't remember exactly who it was, but somebody took us home in a car. So then Jose went with me to my house and I was just complaining like, yo, I can't sit, I can't sit. So I was kind of like riding in the vehicle the whole time on my side. And they took me to my house and when we get to my house, I'm like, yo, don't don't make me sit down. You know, don't make me sit down. Just just lay me down on my chest or whatever. And and one of our friends who was like, you know, further along in his medical career, he was a couple years above us. Um, he comes to examine me and stuff. Right. Because when you're a med student, like going to the hospital, everybody who's going to be there or all your classmates, you know what I mean? So you don't want people to be all up in your business. So you kind of deal with the people you trust. And so my friend, he comes and he's checking me out or whatever. And when Oh boy, pressed on my butt. Where you have this bone in your butt. It's called the coccyx, right? It's like what they call the tailbone. When he touched my tailbone, dude, I wanted to fly out of the bed. It was like, Pew! you know, like I just jumped so hard. I was like, oh! And he's like, yo, man, I think you broke your tailbone, you know? And I was like, dude. So then I was in bed for like two weeks. For like two weeks, I couldn't get up, man. I was just hurting. And still to this day, when I sit down long enough, I still feel that pain. It's like one of them things that it, it never goes away because you have like all these nerves that go through that area. And so I guess I had some nerve damage from that accident that happened all those years ago. And still to this day, I think my butt is broken. So be careful who you ride with because you might just break your butt.